Well, hi, everybody. This is your stay at home grandma, and I'm bringing you my shopping experience, which was really a good experience. I got almond milk and go gurt for the girls, but it's in the bag because my husband's getting ready to take some stuff over. Anyway, moving right along. How's everybody doing? I'm doing fine. Now, this is not in any order, okay? So, I got some food lion, I got some frozen things, I got two of the frozen crinkle cut fudge fries, um, because this thing is for us to have, oh, I got these, these are for my granddaughter, and these are Alexia, and these are organic Yukon um, select french fries, and those are for her, so I got those for her. I don't need bags over there because they go into my little recycle thing. I got some self rising flour for my husband. Um, pre sifted and bleached. But he uses it, so whatever. So this was from Big Luck. This was from Big Luck. Big lots. I found some taco shells. There's 12 taco shells, um, taco seasoning, and taco sauce in there. And this was Ortega, so I got that. I got four pure baking soda because I'm going to make some soap, some more soap powder. I just got my soap in yesterday, so I got four of these. These were 88 cents, I believe. So I thought that that was a good price because I usually pay a dollar for the dollar brand at the dollar store. So I got four of those. I got some perfectly moist pineapple supreme natural flavored cake made with pineapple juice and other natural flavors. And this was Duncan Hines. I never saw this before, but that doesn't mean anything. So I got to get some pineapples. I think I have some. Pretty much I know I do. Because I'm going to make some pineapple upside down cake. And then I'm going to sit here and eat it. You can eat it with me. I don't care. I got now, the whole bill came to $96, and I paid $60 for it with all my coupons. But see, the thing is, I usually plan when I go shopping, I haven't been shopping for two weeks, um, to pay $50 to $55, but I forgot a couple of coupons. My husband got these. These are roasted garlic mashed potatoes. He likes instant mashed potatoes. I don't, but hey. I got whipping cream. I got Land of Lakes butter. I got two points for that. Now he got four of the small country style um, bush baked beans. I did have bushes. I did have a coupon for that. Oh my God. I didn't even see what that was. Well, when you go in there, see, I usually, until this happened, the pandemic, I usually go shopping by myself. But I took my daughter and my husband. And that's not a good thing to do. Now, I had coupons for this. I got two of these. I got the mini and the regular size club um, crackers. And these are buttery kind. Now, they like Ritz, but I like these. I'm sorry. I got two of these. These are the, these were two for five dollars. Actually, they were two for four, but they had them two for five dollars. Mark, and these are the Sunbeam hot dog rolls. This is for Kathy. Oh, this is my cute little hat. This is what they're all wearing in France. 
then this was from where was this from? I'm not really sure. Okay, so this oh this has been from Oh, this is from the Spanish store. I forgot about that. I bought jackfruit. I love jackfruit. I love jackfruit milkshakes. I'll make a milkshake with you and I'll let you see why. If you haven't had jackfruit, try it. Get jackfruit and syrup though. Do not, I repeat, do not. One more time, do not get jackfruit without syrup. Make sure that it says fruit jacquard and syrup. Because if not, it's not gonna be good. They're right here. I just left this in a bag. This is our, our stuff. But this is hers. This is the um That's done. Yeah, the milk and the go -go. So I got three of these. And then let me see what else I got. I forgot the Spanish store. Oh. I found some browning, it's Jamaican browning for gravies and other things. So I got that because you get a little bit of the other one, I forget. What's the browning one that you usually get for gravy? Gravy, gravy Masters. Gravy Masters, and you get a little one and that costs more. And this has the same thing in it that the Gravy Masters have. So we're gonna, we're gonna try this one. I was happy to find that. So, happy this is for you. I'm going to pick it all up when I get finished. Then I got, now this was food buying. And I got two of these, two, two different ones. But these are the Healthy Choice Simple Steamers. Beef chimichurri, okay, and this is my husband's, and this one is mine. This is the, the chicken vegetable, don't forget the diamonds. Oh, okay. Chicken, vegetable, and stir fry. So we got these, and I got these because, you know, sometimes you want to warm up things. And you don't feel like cooking, so I got some of these, and we can put these in the microwave or in the oven. And go along with that. French fries. Huh, those are mine. All right, all right, so I'll just ask the question. And then we'll go another thing with crinkle cut french fries. I thought that was good. Then, I got two things of donuts. I got chocolate donuts for my granddaughter. They came over and helped us empty the car out with the bags. And I got these for my coffee. I'm going to tell you about that coffee maker in a minute, okay? Okay, and all of you who are coffee drinkers are going to go, oh my God. Mm. Then I got another big thing of oatmeal, and this was the quick one minute oats. I don't know why I didn't get this. I thought I bought the old fashioned one, but it's one minute oats and it's lasting and it has good source of fiber. No preservatives and no artificial coloring. Well, of course not. Oh, it was one color. While I was a food line, I was looking at sugar, and I found this one. And this one is white sugar granulated, no gluten, 30 calories um, per two teaspoons, and it's four pounds. Now, I remember when sugar used to be five pounds, but I always seem to, whenever I go, I'll get a sugar okay 
I did not get cane sugar uh, because I have enough cane sugar, but I also use white sugar. At the end of the day, when you go in a hospital, they put white sugar in you when they put the glucose in. So, you know. Oh. Wasn't that great? How I do that? With such care. Okay, so, and then I bought water. You don't need to see that. I bought water at, at um, two big, oh yeah, I forgot to send her water. I'll do it later. Okay, at Big Lots I got some ginger beer. Okay, it is Fetterman's Botanically Brewed Traditional Ginger Beer, a traditional botanical ginger drink with fermented herbal extracts. So that's my drink. Okay, that's enough. And then if BJ's, well, this is mine, but this is where I keep my coupons when I'm going shopping. So let's do this with elegance. Ready and pizzazz. Ready? Wasn't that beautiful? How do I do that? How's everybody doing, by the way? I don't remember whether I asked or not. Okay, so this right here was the cup of coffee that I had at Farmer's Market. There's a story behind this. About three weeks ago, because I haven't been shopping for two weeks, so it was three weeks ago on a Thursday, we went to Farmer's Market because that's when they set aside the time for us. And I was standing there and the, the guy said to me at the, the counter, look, I'm not open up. And I said, what? And he said, you look like you need a cup of coffee. Let me fix you a cup of coffee. And he wasn't open, but he fixed me a cup of coffee. And I went to give him my charge card and he said, look, just when you come back, give me the money. Don't worry about it. He said, you know, whatever. Now, the thing is, I usually don't go. I usually send my daughter. So he didn't know me. So two weeks later today, I go in and I said, you remember me? And he said, no. And I said, but you gave me a cup of coffee. He said, yeah, I remember the look that you had on your face. Like, if I don't get some coffee, I'm going to die. So I said, well, I want a large cup of coffee and blah, 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 blah. And I said, and I'll pay you for the cup of coffee. So I gave him, you know, my charge card and he was open then. So this is the story of the cup of coffee. But there's a little bit more. I get the cup of coffee, and then I spill it. You ever have hot coffee spill on your hand? So he helped me. What a nice guy. He really was. If you ever go to the farmer's market on 13 in Delaware, um, the Newcastle Farmer's Market, go to the coffee stand and tell the guy I sent you. And I should have asked him his name because he was just so sweet and so kind. And, and I paid him, and he said, I never even expected you to pay. And I said, if I, I'm a person of my word. And if I say I'm going to do something, I try to do it. So that's the story of the cup of coffee. Isn't that great? I just tell you so many stories. Okay, so these chips were two for five dollars. And I had a dollar off on each of them, so you know, whatever. So there's two two in here. There's another one. Up here. Those are bad. It was such a mess in class. This is, okay, so now this is all the stuff that I bought at the farmer's market. Well, now I'll, if I can ever get this nut out. That girl nuts it. And I mean, it's good because it's easy to carry, but it's not easy to take out the knot. And I don't like to rip the bags. But I'm going to, I think. I think I got it. Spending the afternoon with me is fun, isn't it? So anyway, um, I don't think that we're going to open up anytime soon. We may open up in intervals, but um, I'm saying, well, see, the thing is, let me, let me tell you, I feel both sides because a lot of people work, okay, and they live from paycheck to paycheck, and I know what that's like because before I finished school and everything like that, I also worked 
and live from paycheck to paycheck too. And um, the funny thing is, okay, these the people who um, they have to go to work, and so I understand that. I just feel bad because I think that there's probably more that the government I don't know can do for them. Because I haven't got my stimulus check, and I doubt that I will because I've been retired for so long now. I mean, I don't know. I haven't followed any taxes. I got it. I got it. So I got peppers. I got oh, four or five of those. I got some collard greens. I got... Oh, those are peppers. I thought those were mangoes. Then I got lemons. Well, I'll show you what the lemon looks like. I got a basket of lemons. They were selling the basket of lemons for three dollars, and I thought that that was a good deal, so I snatched them up. So I'm good. I need my fresh vegetables. When I was going to the store, and I was thinking about in food lines, some of the um. The shelves were almost bare. Not as bad as it was, but some of the shelves were completely wiped out. You know, so I'm thinking I'm really lucky. I'm really blessed because not lucky, but blessed because, you know, um, we do have food and stuff like that. And in different countries, this is the norm. You know what I mean? For everything to be out and everything like that. If you don't get there at a certain time. I forgot who was it that told me. I forgot where she came from. Um, so she was a little girl. Little girl. She was a woman, but she was a little girl. And um, to me. And um, she was telling me that that's the norm for them. You know, the, you know, and this was a while ago. This was before all the, the pandemic happened. She was telling me that, you know, she said, if you don't get to the store at a certain time, everything is gone. So these are the tomatoes that I got. And what I got these for is that I'm going to, I saw a, um, a recipe. Now that's another time for another story, but, and it got stuff tuned in. And I think that I'm going to try that. I think I've tried it before, but we'll see. I think that that would be a nice little salad for my husband and I. Okay, so. Um, I completely forgot about that Spanish store. I usually get my Jumex from the dollar store, but they had, but they only have mango, guava, and strawberry and banana. I don't like the strawberry and banana. I don't like that, but I like the the, ma the mango and the guava. But in the Spanish store. They had apple nectar, okay, and then they had they had peach nectar, so I got that. So we'll see. I know what the peach tastes like. I've never had the, the apple before, but we'll see, and I'll tell you how that tastes. Um, but you never see this in the dollar store. But I did ha get it out of the Spanish store, so I was really happy. Okay. Okay, so let's see what else. We're almost done. Got about four more, I think. Oh, these were from the, the store, the Mark Farmers Market. These are pears. This is, I only got one of these, the shallot, or the shallot, but it's a shallot, okay? These are the mangoes. These are not ripe yet. They're just as hard as my head. And these are, this is the cucumber. So I got that. That's salad. So this is the other... These were two for, and these are the big ones. I like these these um, crackers. Okay, so let's see what else I got. Oh, these were two for four dollars too. 
And yeah, I know people say, she makes it. But sometimes, okay, in my defense, I'm old. So sometimes I just don't feel like making it. But this was sweet raspberry vinegar net, vinegar net. Really? Vinaigrette. And this is classic ranch, of which I like both. I got some um, lemonade turkey hill. Okay, so we would be coming down to the wire. I've got four more bags. This is Big Lots. I got the Husky drawstring kitchen bags. And they're double thick. I'm because I'm getting down to the bottom of them, so I do need some kitchen bags. I got this is nice. The, the, the package of Epsom salt and I have two I got a sale I want to say around the first of the year of some Epsom salt but this was Dr. Teal's and this was um, pure Epsom salt therapeutic soap for aches and, it eases aches and pains soothes sore muscles and tired feet fat, this fast dissolving ultra fine crystal and this was six pounds, okay? This was five dollars. Dr. Teal, okay, is usually very expensive. So I I should probably should have got two, but I got one. I'll probably kick myself for not getting two. I got beans. These were the black beans were 59 cent a can. That wasn't bad. Okay. So I think I got I got what I got. I also got chili beans. These were 59 cent a can. I know I got two cans of these. And then I got four cans of the kidney beans. So I guess all together, well, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I got eight cans. Okay, so those will go in my little stash for when I want to make chili or I want a bean soup or something like that. last one. Got my husband some Maps Chicharron pork strips. He likes those. I do too actually. Got some coconut milk. These were 88 cents. Yeah, but either a dollar 88 cents. I forgot how much those were. And then I got some garlic powder. Garlic pepper seasoning. That's what I thought. Got garlic powder. I got mayonnaise. And I got some more um, coconut milk. Like we were going to go up to the other Spanish um, farmer's market. But I go to the farmer's market close to my home. The other Sp Spanish market is in another genre. And it, it's a good Spanish market. Trust me. But I hate driving up there. Okay. I think what I'm really doing is I'm hating to drive at all. Last but not least, this is my husband's meat. And he got this also from Farmer's Market. And in this was 
Okay, shave steak. Got a bunch of it. What a fire. See, I let him buy the meat other than the chicken. Because he knows what he's doing. And then he got. Oh, oxtail. And that's it. So if you like this, like, share, and subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. I'm going to put all my groceries up. Have me a late lunch. And I will talk to you all later. I love you. Take care. God bless. Be safe. Have fun, but be safe. Bye-bye. See you in the next video. Adios.